divorce. Divorce is defined as the dissolution of a marriage by judicial decree or accepted custom. I'm Phil Bates and I teach law for the Open University. Divorce to me, because I teach law, I think of it as a legal concept. It's the way in which marriages are brought to an end by legal process. But obviously that doesn't capture the whole reality of divorce. Divorce has an emotional meaning for the people who are going through it. It has practical consequences and those practical and emotional consequences can run on for years after the legal proceedings have come to an end. If you get divorced, there's likely to be two legal consequences that you might be looking towards. One is you need to get divorced if you want to remarry, because if you remarry without getting divorced from your first spouse, you'll be committing bigamy. The other reason, more commonly, is that people need to sort out the financial consequences of the relationship. They need to separate out the property and financial aspects during the marriage in some kind of way that allows them to get on with their lives. Unfortunately, the law doesn't do very much to help people deal with the emotional consequences of the ending of a marriage. But there may be very little that the law can do. It may be that counseling, mediation, family support are much more important in dealing with the long-term emotional consequences than the legal system is.